Don't forget to subscribe. Subscribe. <laughs> it's Toopy Toys. Do you know that Toopy Toys is out of this world? Hey guys, it's Tiffany from Tubi Toys here, and today I have a lot of Incredibles 2 stuff to show you. I've been holding on to this stuff for a while, and I've been meaning to show it to you. I just haven't had any time. So let's get started. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, and please subscribe to Tubi Toys. If you are new to Tubi Toys, please, please let us know in the comments below. We love talking to our new subscribers and our older subscribers. We love talking to everybody, especially when you say nice things. So thank you very much. Anyway, let's get started. What I have here is the Hydro Liner set. We've already showed you this in another video, but I wanted to give you a closer look of it again. We also have some villains. Well, yeah, we have two villains to show you. We have the Screen Slaver, we have him, and we also have the Underminer, and we also have Frozen, and these are part of the Junior Supers collection. These are the pre-cool, preschool figures so for ages three and up. They're really, really awesome. I also have some more closer looks of the um, the figures, so we're gonna get right down to it. So let's go. Let's start with the Hydro Liner set. We had a really fun skit that we showed you before, a couple days ago, and I just wanted you to get a closer look. Now this set is really, really big. It retails for $39.99, and I actually got it for $34.99 on Amazon. Whoa, for, uh, I got it for $34.99 on Amazon. You have to really just watch it because they do go on sale. I don't know why, but I pre-ordered this when it first came out. Maybe that's why. So this is really cool. It comes with this really cool life preserver, a hypnotized Mrs. Incredible. How crazy is that? Look at her eyes. She's under some sort of spell. And she also has frozen legs. So she was definitely in this chamber that I'm gonna show you in a little bit. It also has a bunch of openings. So it can open from the front and an ice slide pops out which is really awesome because we do have Frozone to open today so we will put him to work. On the side there's a double door with the incredible symbol and this opens up. So what's supposed to go inside of this is the mini speedboat. So the mini speedboat will go inside here and I'm going to explain why we need that speedboat. So on the other side, there is this extendable arm right here. It looks kind of like Mrs. Incredible elastic arm, but it's a bendy arm. It comes out, goes back in, and it can actually, you know, hit an enemy, you know, help help you out to like get an opponent or whatever. It's pretty cool. There's this, and it bends up. It's really awesome. Now inside this is a cooling chamber. Now I don't know if you notice this right here but it has like these like goggles. So it seems to me that this chamber, oh, it comes off, that's good, because I need it to come off. This chamber right here, it's going to put in one of the supers. You close it up, and they look through these goggles right here, and it hypnotizes them even more. And it's, since it's a cooling chamber, it keeps them cold. That's why Mrs. Incredibles, or Elastigirl's legs look Frozen, they're translucent. It's a translucent blue. At first, when I saw it on the box, I'm like, oh, maybe this is for Frozen, but I don't know. I really don't know the whole storyline yet. I only got a little bit from the Golden Book. I'm not buying any other books because that's the age range that I have right now. So, anyway, this thing is really cool. It spins around. It has like some like doodads on the back, and then right in front of it is a trap door. This side opens, and look. There's where she fell, down there. And look what's right there. Look, the speedboat. So we're gonna put her inside. Whoa. And she comes out on the other end. Really, really, really cool. We have like the 
the motor thing. I don't know what this is called, but it moves from side to side. Now, another cool part of this Hydroliner set is right on top. There is a launcher, so you could launch projectiles. All you have to do is just press this button right here, and then even the figure, you can have them stand right over here, and they can mold their hands around the handles, and they could move around and fall off the boat, and they could move it around and then just press the projectile button. And it spins 360 degrees, and look at this, how cool. Oh, here we go. And why isn't it shooting out? Boom. It comes with two projectiles, which is really awesome. And it uses the same projectiles that the Incredibile uses as well. It also has like inside the actual boat Inside you see like all these like these little graphics or whatever and a real spinning steering wheel. This part goes up, this side goes Does it go up? This side does not go up. Only one side does. This, I don't know what this does. Aha, uh -huh, I figured it out. It's to hold the life preserver. It does not open up. It does have the Incredibles logo on the top, so it's a little bit confusing it does look like it's supposed to open but that's what it does it holds a life preserver pretty cool for $39.99 it comes with a lot of stuff and I like that it comes with a figure that you're not going to normally get like this Elastigirl this preserver which has some significance and the launchers it's a pretty cool set oh also I forgot to mention it has wheels guys I know you probably saw that from the other video look there's like wheels on the bottom. You cannot play with this in the water, okay? Do not put this set in the water. There's no like electronic parts, but it's not made for the water. It will not float, it will sink. Let's move on to the other stuff that I have. I'm so excited to show you guys the screen slaver figure. I found this at Toys R Us. They were selling for 35% off. This is so cool, I'm so happy. Okay, so we have the Elastigirl figure that we got with the sidecar, her Elasti um, Elasticycle. So now we have a duplicate of that, but we have Screensaver. Here is Screenslaver. So cool and so, oh my gosh, so, so movable and poseable. Look, he can move his wrist or she, he or she can move his wrist. We don't know what or who is behind this mask. Very, very, very bendable. Can't bend its legs. Can turn his head. He's got like this like weird things in his backpack. Very, very, very cool. Kind of looks like a fly, if you ask me. Doesn't it look like a fly? Whoa really really cool figure and I'll show you the Elastigirl that it came with. Here is Elastigirl. She looks normal. She has her brown eyes here so it looks like she's not under Screen Slaver's spell. Really really cool and she's also quite posable. She could twist her arms. She can bend her legs. Not at the knee though only at the hip and she could turn her head pretty cool these are really awesome figures I had mentioned this in the past we play these with these figures with our Imaginex figures because they're like almost identical like to in size not identical in figure but like their size so like you know we play with them with our Teen Titans and our other um, like DC Comics Imaginex figures which is really really fun next we have Violet and Frozone now there is another set of figures that I don't have it was um, it was regular Mrs. Incredible with Dash, and I'm not gonna get them because I already have them, and I'm not gonna buy the Mr. Incredible with Jack-Jack. There's no difference. I'll show you close-ups of them if you haven't seen them yet. But here is Violet and Frozone. I'm so happy they came out with Frozone. Here is Frozone. He's so cool. He is poseable. His arms go up and down. I love how their wrists like rotate and their legs bend. This is so cool. He is awesome. He's like one of my favorite characters. And here is a duplicate of Violet. 
never can have too many violet, but like look at her arm. Oh my gosh, it's like broken. It looks totally like discolored. She is so awesome though. She's super bendy. And she's so cute. Love Violet. Just in case you haven't seen Mr. Incredible or Elastigirl or Dash or Jack Jack, I'm gonna show you them now. Here's baby Jack Jack. He's so cute. And his arms go up and down and his legs go straight. He is so cute. Here is Mrs. Incredible. Now, if you're looking to buy the whole family, they do sell a five pack. And I have to remember, I can't really remember how much it was. I think it was maybe $9.99 for the five pack but you have to just check my description to be sure and you can get them or just buy them individually which is going to cost you more money but you're not going to be able to find screen slaver or frozone without buying any other two packs let's say you want to do that and you just want to buy them individually mr incredible comes with his incredible and the elastigirl figure comes with her elasticycle and here is dash he's so cool they all have the same movements, except Dash, which is so weird, can't really move that well. Mr. Incredible is the largest out of all of them. Look at him. And he is super poseable. He is awesome. Now the violet in the back is the same violet that I already showed you. Let me show you the Incredible if you haven't seen it. This is the Incredible. It is so cool. This is Mr. Incredible's amazing sports car it has a turbo jet in the back that actually spins while you drive it it's pretty cool there are also projectiles all you have to do is just press down the seat the hood opens up and look at that there's launchers ready to be fired at you super cool and you just put them back down and then he drives away see how cool that is Awesome. Let's talk about the Elasticycle. This is Elastigirl's Elasticycle. This is really, really awesome. This also pro shoots projectiles. You know where? In the headlight. Look at this. So super cool. It comes with two of those. And I love the design of that because it looks like the headlight. This is so cool too. All you have to do is to make it extend, to make it go like super fast. You press the Elastigirl logo. And look at that. The wheels come out and there's also a removable sidecar and it just attaches easily like this and then I put all of the kids in it I'm sure just baby Jack Jack's gonna go inside there but it's really really cool and it comes with this Elastigirl figure and I like the way that she sits on the actual bike just like a real motorcycle so cool Let's move on to the Tunneler playset. Last but not least, we have the Underminer. I am not sure how much of the Underminer we're going to see in this film because we did see a little tidbit of him in Incredibles Part 1. Here is the Tunneler playset. It comes with the Underminer and a lot of cool accessories. You can shoot, extend, and launch the boiler. Oh my gosh, now there's so many questions that are now answered the boiler that mrs incredible came with when she's doing that high kick from that mini playset from our like other video that we did we did so many incredible videos so far this is oh my god this is a part of it how crazy is that so cool this set comes with the tunneler a projectile the boiler one underminer figure and three accessories before i show you the toy i just want to show you the inside of the box look how cool seriously Look at the detail in that box. How awesome is that? This is something that no one's really even gonna look at. And look at what Jack Specific did. The packaging is amazing. So, so, so cool. I love that. That is so cool that they did that. Well done, Jax. Oh my gosh, I love it. So cool. Here we have the Tunneler. This is such a crazy contraption. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness, look at that! Does it move when you drive it? <gasps> it does! Oh my gosh! That is cool. Okay, here's our projectile. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Oh 
That is really cool. Okay, and I guess if you need to press this red button at the top. Oh, oh my gosh, that comes out like super fast. Be really, really careful. If you don't point that at anybody's face. Oh my goodness. That is so cool. All right, let's launch this again. One more time. Ah, get in there. There we go. There seems to be another button over here. What is this? Oh, cool. Look, there's the boiler. Does this open? Ah, cool, cool, cool. Oh, I love it. You know what I love? I love these green frosted windows. And this is the set right here. This is the thing that comes up. Oh my gosh. This is the coolest, the coolest toy ever. Okay, let's show you the underminer now. Here he is in all of his glory. He looks like a beaver. He has buck teeth. Look at him. Oh my gosh, he has a cape. Oh no, no capes. <gasps> I wonder why he has a cape. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's see if we can turn his head. Turn his head a little bit. Does his cape come off? <gasps> it does. It comes off. Oh my gosh. So was he the super that like went bad or like, I wonder, hmm. How? Cool. So his cape comes off, and he doesn't have hands. He has like these like robotic. Ooh, he has these like robotic like fingers, and he has the same posable capabilities as the other ones. Except I think he is actually a pretty cool figure. There's a lot of detail to him. Don't see his eyes. He has a really cool helmet. He's awesome. And he has a hole in the bottom of his foot, so we can put him on his extendable arm right here. This little platform, let's put him on that. He looks so cool. So, so, so cool. The Underminer. And let's show you what he comes with. He comes with, I think this is a, a pickaxe. And here is a shovel and I don't know what this is it looks like a microphone super cool I love it so he's working down here he's working down here he's got his controls or whatever and then when he comes out he rises up and I'm guessing because it says it's a boiler, it's always hot in there. I really don't know. But there's no like little places for you to like stick these things. So we just they go in here. But can we put them in his hands? Let's see. Oh, he can, he can hold his shovel. And can he hold his pickaxe? Yes, he can. Really awesome. Here is the boiler. This boiler is also something that can be launched. Let's do this. So that little button that I pressed before that I thought opened up the actual thing was not actually what it was supposed to be. I'll just, I'm gonna show you that in a second. Okay, so this yellow thing snaps in and watch this. Get ready. Ready? <laughs> that wasn't what I expected. Nice little pop-up though. That's fun. I'm going to show you at this angle so you can get a better look of what it does. Watch. It works better sideways. But I really like the fact that you can launch something when it's laying horizontally. That's really, really cool. And when you're done playing, you can put everything back inside all snugly. Really, really, really cool toy. And what's really awesome about it is that you can take it anywhere you want. You could put the figures inside. Let's see how many figures we could put inside. So let's say you're going over to somebody's house. You want to bring your toys. Let's say you bring Frozone. Got to bring Elastigirl. I don't know if Mr. Incredible is going to fit, but let's see. Mr. Incredible in there. We got Elastigirl. Oh, I think that we really reached capacity with the tunneler. Cannot fit. 
I can't get him in. Let's throw in screensaver then. All right. Oh, it's a party in there. You can place the weapons inside here if you want. Well, now that we have Frozen out, let's see if he can slide down that ice slide. So cool. So here's the ice slide. And can Frozen slide down? Nope, maybe he'll... Whee! He's actually too wide for it. Woo! How many people head first? <laughs> he still gets caught. That's it for now, guys. Let us know which one is your favorite in the comments below. Out of everything, I think the Tunneler is my favorite. There's a lot of cool things that you could play with. A lot of cool things that pop up and you could shoot. And this is really, really cool. And I love the fact that the, the figure is so different than the other ones. I like that he has a removable cape too. So awesome. And it's a great, great price point. Get to Toys R Us now. See if you can grab it. It's so awesome. Well, thank you so much for watching, guys. Have a great day. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and please subscribe to Tubi Toys. Thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to subscribe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. Don't forget to subscribe. It's free. Thanks, guys. Have a great day.